everybody and welcome back to Investment Honey where we talk about various crypto projects. Before we begin, I want to let you know that I am not your financial advisor. I do not provide financial advice on the channel and I don't even encourage you to invest. But what I am going to do is share with you my own personal opinion and views on the channel um, with concerning the you know, crypto project that we discuss you know, uh, in each episode. So with that said, we're going to talk about the Subterra project. Uh, it says here, building underground facilities to safeguard the inhabitants, a revolutionary concept and one of a kind vision. They do have a video here that kind of you know explains a bit more in terms of you know what the project's about. And I'm going to go ahead and play that play that for you now. Disasters can strike at any time. Economies can collapse and riots arise. The human race could be in danger. We have to be prepared. Introducing Subterra, a massive, fully functional hotel built underground. The hotel will be built to withstand disasters and with the scope of protecting the inhabitants for as long as possible. At Subterra, all the safety and security protocols to preserve the human race will be in place, providing state-of-the-art facilities such as medical care, food production and stocking, waste recycling, self-sustainable energy on a 24-7 schedule in and out of harm's way environment. Our fully trained professionals will take care of all your personal needs when you arrive and your well-being will be our top priority. Be prepared. So yeah, uh, so really, uh, really, really interesting uh, concept. So, you know, but as I would say with any cryptocurrency project, you know, um, uh, you know, just my own question in terms of, you know, whether the team has the skill set to be able to pull it off, you know, and, you know, obviously this is going to be, as they said, a massive project, you know, so um, with that said, it says here, we live in an unpredictable world where everything is uncertain, where there is no insurance or a warranty that we or our loved ones will have a safe future from all the probable disasters, which may occur at any time. Um, we will never know what's coming and how much is going to affect us, but the probability is there. We have to do our best to greatly improve our chances of surviving. We cannot just sit and pray to be spared, but we can keep trying to raise awareness to prepare, to be ready, and act when needed. So, welcome to Subterra, a full-scale underground hotel. Call it a fortress, a place where people united by the same dreams and ideologies merge together to create an extraordinary project, a place where the safety and security of our residents will be our top priority. So, um, you know, they give you some information in regards to easy integration and versatility, real data analysis of potential disasters, um, maximizing potential through scalability, building a sustainable project. Uh, quote here, it, also, it always seems impossible until it's done by Nelson Mandela. An unprecedented division concept and design, impeccable reality, you know, reliability, and just you know, more information here. Taking pride in their forecast, you know, so is basically what the roadmap's going to look like, you know, in terms of, um, you know, what they're thinking. And so here, it starts in May of 22 that the main uh, project is going to be, um, or the site, you know, is going to be released, you know. So obviously, you know, we're in, you know, in February, so it will cover more in depth all, uh, all aspects related to the project. So. This to me signals that there's going to be a lot more development in terms of this website. So there's more information that's going to be coming before they can really call it a complete website, you know, with all the details concerning uh, their projects. So moving into July, uh, three concept plans of the projects was going to be released to the public in 3D presentation. You know, one of them is going to be chosen as the final project and the city name will be chosen through a public vote. I think that's pretty cool. October 2022, the first lane is going to be bought through or concession plan submitted to or for approval to local authority. In March 2023, getting the site ready to welcome our first module, it will be used as a display show module and will never be sold. The module will have a, a nickname chosen by the public. In December 2023, 90, 90 modules uh, ready uh, at a build rate of 10 per month. Starting the interconnecting process will mark the birth of our first underground fortress. So, um, you know, again, anytime we're talking about a roadmap, you know, I like to see this is going to be more, more you know, updates, you know, more information, innovation going on beyond, you know, just the end of the roadmap, you know, so I'd like to be able to see that. But either way, they've got some massive stuff, you know, going on in terms of, uh, you know, the benchmarks of trying to go ahead and hit, you know, uh, on this roadmap. So now uh, it says here, are you ready? You're reading a concept from a seed idea on a seed site. So they're calling this a seed site. So again, this is another indication that they're not fully done with this, with this site yet. So. Um, but again, you can imagine that there's going to be more, a lot more information coming in regards to the project. You know, so also want to note that they do have a white paper um, and um, you know, I'll go ahead and leave a link for that in the description. <clears throat> they also do say that there are plans to have this 
audited and KYC through solid proof before the deployment of the contract. So I want to go ahead and also mention that to you too. So, I mean, um, with that said, this is a very, very interesting project. Um, if you're somebody interested in looking at it a little bit further, you know, beyond anything that I've conveyed in this video regarding the project, by all means, please do so. I'll go ahead and I'll leave the relevant uh, links in the description for you along with how you can get some free BTC, you know, by engaging, you know, with those links in the description. And as always, I appreciate you guys watching the videos that I've released on the channel. If you guys like the videos, follow me and subscribe and, um, you know, turn on the notifications so you are notified of when I release new content. With that said, you guys enjoy the day.